Hey guys, LP here with your jump fly ball training tip of the week. This week, I'm at the Team Canada Training Center in Gatineau. Uh, I'll be helping with the B team this summer and we just finished tryouts. And I saw a couple of things during those tryouts that I wanna talk about in the next couple of tips. And those are things that will help you coaches work with your athletes because I think they're things that our younger athletes, you know, when they're 14, 15, 16, can learn and, uh, and implement in their games so that when they get to a higher level, so a university, college, or when they try out for a national team, well, then they'll be able to apply. So, um, so here's the first of those uh, two tips that I wanna talk to you about. So the first tip is for uh, right-handed players that hit out of the right side. So what I see a lot is players coming in an angle. So they come in an angle from outside the court, all right? They come in like this, and what that does is that, yes, it allows them to hit a really hard cross-court shot, but it's really hard for right-handed players to hit a line shot coming into an angle when they hit from the right side, okay, from position two. So my tip okay, for all the right-handed players is to really start from inside the court, okay? So start from inside the court and come in a straight line and keep your shoulders facing the net. So you can let the ball go in front of you, be squared to the line so you're able to hit hard line, but as a right-handed person, you also are able to let the ball go and cut it off and hit to the cross court. So by coming in a straight line and keeping your shoulders facing the net, you will be able to hit a hard line and also get um, a hard cross court shot. So this is my tip for this week. You can try it if you're an athlete. You can teach your athletes to do that. Try it and you will see it's, uh, it's way, be way better, way easier to hit as a right-handed uh, player. And this is also true for all high ball situations. So really a good tip. And also left-handed players, you can try that out of the left side. So, um, so yeah, so that's the tip for this week. Let me know how it goes and I'll catch you next week for another useful volleyball tip.